How's it going guys, Oliver here from WinBeta and today I'll be examining the music discovery function in Windows 10 Mobile. In Windows Phone 8.1, the music discovery function, which identifies any song that's being played nearby that can be heard by the phone's microphone, was found at the top right of the Cortana search function. In Windows 10 Mobile, this convenient feature initially seems to have vanished, but in fact it's simply been relocated. As of build 10586.29, the music discovery function is found first by tapping the hardware search button to summon Cortana, then on the microphone button for Cortana's voice command. A music button will then pop up on the top right, but not after about a second or so of intense meditation on Cortana's part. Tap on that button and you finally get to use a function that was 30 times more transparent in Windows Phone 8.1. Seriously, Microsoft, why? <laughs> why? Things become even more insidious when trying to look up your music discovery search history to find a song you heard while shopping earlier, for example. In Windows Phone 8.1, you could find your music searches sandwiched between Cortana's hamburger buns. In Windows 10 Mobile, as far as I can tell, the only way to access your music search history is by invoking the listening function. So you have to have your phone listen for a song to search for a song you listened for earlier. This can cause some usability issues. If you're looking for a previous song while, say, listening to the radio, your music search will be interrupted by Cortana jumping up and down telling you that she found the song you're not actually looking for. Now, I wouldn't be surprised to see Microsoft change this Byzantine behavior in the near future. What I'm wondering though is why did they change this in the first place? It was fine before. Well anyway, I hope you found this little dissection informative. Look forward to more dissecting Windows 10 mobile posts from us in the future. Thanks for watching.